Hello everyone. Uh, as part of the continuous innovation program uh, on the Oracle eBusiness Suite product, um, a few days ago, uh, to be more precise, uh, August 16th, uh, Oracle announced the availability of the release 12.2.9, uh, which includes many new features, corrections, and some statutory and regulatory um, uh, requirements. Uh, and updates. Um, so it's a consolidated uh, patch. Uh, there are some things that you need to do in order to go from uh, uh, prior releases of 12.2. Um, there are two paths in the, and you can find information in a readme file, uh, but there are two ways, path A and path B, uh, to go through um, uh, the app update of your current eBusiness suite. Uh, I've been working on uh, evaluating all the different uh, new features. I'm counting on the applications technology just for 12.2.9, about 47 updates. Uh, on the financial side, about 10 uh, that are important. Uh, in human capital uh, management, 11. Uh, there's uh, in manufacturing about 17. Uh, order management and contracts about 11. Uh, on procurement, there's about 18 for all the modules across you know, these different product families. So we're counting about, you know, about 200 uh, overall in EBS, uh, the, the updates and new features and changes uh, on uh, just new features uh, that are on the release content document available on my Oracle support. Uh, let me let me mention some of, of the most important ones. Uh, we're talking about, you know, on the financials, there's uh, some regulatory uh, updates, um, lease management, there's some few updates. In order management uh, for all the recurring, there's uh, uh, updates on that. Um, in the logistics um, family, uh, there's a very important addition of uh, approvals management engine uh, that allows you to do parallel approvals, etc. cetera. Um, there's, as I mentioned, there's a few good updates on procurement, uh, adding a, 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 a approvals management engine, uh, as well as some new features for, you know, like you know, passports on ISO supplier, etc. Um, there's a, a good uh, update on, on projects for project costing and project billing. Uh, so many, many new features that are, uh, I'm more than happy uh, to go over you if you are interested on a one-to-one -one, or, or we can meet at Open World. Um, IT Conversions is going to have a, a booth there and I'm going to be more than happy to go through all the different changes and new features that are available on 12.2.9 as well as trying to share with you uh, how IT Conversions can help you uh, with an uh, Oracle EVC Suite assessment uh, that it works for customers that are running on 12.1 uh, or 12.2 and what is the journey to be digital on EVs and Suite and using EVs and Suite. Uh, so I'm very happy to, to help you with that. You know, just let me know uh, and I'll be available. Thank you very much.